What's going on? YouTube Metal Complex here and today I've got another short little unboxing to share with you guys. This box was sent by the Apex Passaround Group, so by extension usually that means uh, sent by the manufacturer, so uh, I appreciate it. If you would like your own Rainbow Lady of the Sea for your own unboxing adventures or adventures of any type, or you're looking for cool uh, EDC or knife maintenance items such as this Wee A Bit Selector or Wee A Bit Driver, um, which work really well together, that's magnetic, or you're looking for maybe uh, some cool budget knives, or maybe you're looking for um, possibly something that's a tad bit more expensive, maybe USA made, whatever it is that you're looking for, there are links down in the description where you can get this stuff for yourself this holiday season or a loved one or if you're watching this six months in the future get it for whatever season it is <laughs> it's fun to unbox stuff you like watching me unbox stuff imagine unboxing some stuff for yourself you're like oh you're getting crafty with that complex trying to reel us in by getting us to imagine doing the unboxings on our own okay anyways let's get into this box what do we have? What do we have? Something in bubbles and tape. Let's get through that. Thank you, Lady of the Sea, for being infinitely sharp. What is this? Okay, this is completely new. I have no idea what this is. Okay, I really like the weight right off the bat. Really like the contoured carbon fiber. Really like the... God, is that anode titanium purple and blue? Ooh. Okay, what uh, what do we have here? This is awesome. What is this? Is there anything else? No? Okay, um, I really like this right off the bat. This is awesome. Um, man, okay, we must have, yeah, garaged stops underneath this carbon fiber. Liner lock comes perfectly centered. Dang, that is a classy little knife there, guys. Um, okay, so I will figure out exactly what this is. I'm getting my fingerprints off of it. And I will leave the name of it down in the description and I'll also try to pin a comment so you guys know exactly what you're looking at. If there's a link I can provide where you can pick it up for yourself along with this stuff and everything else that I talked about, then I'll put that down there too. But um, this, is, this is beautiful. It's very, very smooth. It has that feel of a higher end knife, but it also makes me, you know, wonder, given everything I've handled in the budget world or from the budget world lately, if this isn't a budget knife. I don't know. Um, I really like it though. <laughs> this gives me sort of a ZT0452 vibe mixed with some Shirogorov, kind of. Very, um, that's kind of what it makes me think of. But uh, not the biggest fan of the pocket clip. That's what's making me think it's not a super insanely expensive knife, but everything else about it feels really, really nice. Um, okay, guys, that's going to be pretty much it for today's short little unboxing. As usual, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. If you'd like to check out my other content, I do, of course, have lots of videos of knives that are either expensive or inexpensive that I do or don't like, so check those out. And if you enjoy all my content, go ahead and click on this Metal Complex logo right here and subscribe because there's definitely a lot more coming. Thanks again for watching, everybody, and have a great day.